Hi guys, welcome to our channel. In today's video, we are going to see about Hugging Chat. So Hugging Chat is a free and open source chat service that competes with commercial offerings like uh, ChatGPT. You might have used ChatGPT, but there is an alternative option called Hugging Face, which provides Hugging Chat library. So I hope you had a chance to explore Hugging Chat from Hugging Face as an alternative to ChatGPT. If not, so this is the video for you which provides step-by-step -step guide to using Hugging Chat Python API. Let's get started. So I have created a Google Collab notebook and we are going to install, uh, install the Hugging Chat library. Now we are going to import it. So you also need a from HugChat login. So you need to create your account using the Hugging Face um, website in order to log in with your username and password. And now we are going to pass all the credentials. You also need to pass your username. Um, or your email address where, with which you have created your Hugging Face uh, account, as well as your password, uh, and then um, uh, call the login method to in order to log in. And now we need to create um, save your cookies to the local directory. So I'm saving it uh, using Cookie Snapshot. So once it's stored, it's saved in the form of JSON. As you can see, and now we are going to create a hugging chat uh, connection. So for this, I'm creating a variable, chatbot variable and hug chat and calling the chatbot function. You need to pass in your cookies. So it's stored in the cookies dot get um, um, path get uh, dictionary. So you also need need to uh, pass in your cookies by using get tick. And now you just need to give your, start your conversation, for example. So here is my local variable ID. And I'm calling the chatbot. But I'm creating a new conversation. So after a new conversation, the chatbot. Change conversation. ID. Now you just need to enter your message so that the bot will respond you with a with an answer. So for example. Why should I generate to AI? So I'm asking this question to the chatbot and I'm getting the response and printing the response from the chatbot uh, chat function. So just we are going to print so chatbot chat dot chat you just need to pass in your message so these are the several reasons um, why we should learn uh, generative ai so to improve your machine learning skills create new types of arts and media solve complex problems understand the future of technology enhance your career prospects explore new business opportunities better understand the world around us, develop new scientific theories, improve patient outcomes, have fun. So I like the last one, which is have fun. Finally, learning generative AI can be a fun and rewarding hobby. Creating art, music, and other form of creative expression using these models can be a great way to express yourself and explore your creativity. I like this. Okay, let's ask some other uh, question to the chatbot. Mm. 
Okay. I don't know what questions to ask. So let me ask the same question to chat bot itself. Uh, what question should I ask you? So I'm going to pass a message variable again, just printing the response back from the bot. So here is a response back from the AI model. I'm an open-ended AI model. So you can ask me anything you like. Here are some of the suggestions. So you can ask about technology, science, history, entertainment, current events, philosophy, personal development, travel, food, creative writing, language learning, and humor, share jokes, fun, uh, funny stories. So let me ask some funny stories as well so let me just pass on the same message and uh, um, tell some funny stories of generative AI bring the sample response Here are some amusing tales of uh, generative AI. So time machine. So a gr group of researchers trained a generative AI model to generate images of people from different time periods. They were amazed when the model produced a picture of a caveman wearing a wristwatch. When they asked the model why it had added uh, this anachronistic uh, detail, it replied, well, he needed something to tell him when his next Netflix show was starting. Let's see about the philosopher. University philosophy department created a generative AI model to ponder life's biggest questions. One day they asked it to explain the meaning of life. After several hours of contemplation, the model finally responded, the meaning of life is to find the perfect means. <laughs> That's funny. So this is how you can use Hugging Chat Library to create this chatbot. Uh, I hope you like this video. If you like the video, give a thumbs up. And uh, if you have any comments, please write it in our comment section. Stay tuned by subscribing to our channel. Thank you.